Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm your host Dana and today we are doing a Shop Miss A haul, honey. Um, I just got this in the mail a few days ago and I said, let me share because they have like a really big sale going on right now. You might be interested in getting some good deals, okay? So let's go ahead and get into this. I will put down my referral and affiliate link down below if you guys wanna go check it out. Um, the first thing we're gonna talk about is a tried and true uh, item that I buy all the time. Um, this is the AOA Studio Natural Finish, um, medium to full coverage, okay? Good for all skin types. And this particular color is in nude. Now, um, they had another color that I wanted, but it was sold out. So I just need to go back and check every now and then. But this works so well. Now, I normally use the IT Full Coverage BB, BB Cream. Um, you know, it's expensive. And it's very effective. But then so is this. For, I think this is like a dollar and some change. So let me show you what it does, okay? This, again, is in the color Nude. Let's see. Now, I have really bad raccoon eyes. So I've done some get ready, get ready with me, putting on makeup. See that little dot? Um, you see that coverage? A little goes a long way. You see that? Look at that. Beautiful. So this does some amazing raccoon eye coverage. I'm trying to tell you. AOA liquid concealer. All right. So there you go. I used, I've been using this for over two, three years now. Yeah. As soon as it came out, I have bought it. Okay. So that's, you know, that's a go-to item for me. Um, the next thing is this. I've never tried this one. This is the Plush Blush. And this is Paw Paw. So anything that has Paw Paw, they send some money towards, um, they donate money towards animals for their care somehow. Whenever you see the Paw Paw, that's what they're doing. They're donating some proceeds of your purchase. So this is a cream blush. Never tried it. Brand new to me. And let me tell you the color first, if I can see what the color is. Um, cum cumulus. So this one is Cumulus. C-U-M-U-L-U-S. I know it's a very odd name. Cumulus. You guys see that? Cumulus. Well, let's see what it looks like. Okay. What is this? Okay. So it comes out like this. It's a lot of product. Almost looks like a nail polish, but it's a blush. Okay. So this is Cumulus. And this is supposed to be a blush. So I'm just going to tap because I was trying to look for something that gives me like a rosy flow. That's pretty. I can see it more rosy here than you guys can see here on the screen. Let me, I can see it's like a nice natural rosy look for me over here. So this is going to work out well. Okay. Now that's like putting it on too much, obviously. See that? But when I first did it, you saw I was able to blend it in and it had like a nice rosy glow. So you can't really see it there, but I could see it here in person. See? Okay. So there you have it. Paw Paw Cumulus. I know. Let me get some of this because this girl has a lot of product. I know this whole tissue thing just like tore to shreds. All right. I'm just trying to take some of it off now. There we go. And in the trash it goes. Okay. The next item I wanted to share with you was this one. Um, this one is the Malibu Glitz. Okay. And this is a Sunkiss Trio Bronzer. Now, let me see if I could pop her open. They have three different kinds. All right. And I really wanted to use this not as a bronzer, but more like a sculpting. You know, put it underneath my cheekbones. I wanted it for that. So the color is dark, but I got it like that for a reason. So I'm going to show you what it looks like. That's the highlight right there. That's the bronze right here. And then this is the darker. Okay. So there you go. And that's going to look really nice when I use it as a sculpting, a sculpting thing. <laughs> I love that. A sculpting thing. I'm going to use it for a sculpting thing. Okay. Let me see if I can like rub that off here. All right. Um, the next thing I wanted to share with you is this really cute compact 
um, it had little cupcakes on it and I had to get it. I did. I wanted to get a new mirror for my purse and these are super light. They weigh like nothing and I don't want any more weight to my purse. So I know these are super light and they're effective. Um, you get two mirrors. Booyah. There you go. Why aren't you closing? Did you guys just jinx me? There we go. Okay. She's closed. There you go. And so that's another product that I wanted to get. And it was super cute. All right. Then um, they had this new papaya and vitamin E. This is an essential derma renew um, serum. I don't know why I said essential, but it's a serum, you guys. It's from AOA. And I've never tried it. So I got the smaller bottle. It was on sale. Everything I got, I picked up was on sale. Oh, wow. It smells very nice. Smells like papaya. So I wanted to see if I could use these for my cuticles, not necessarily for my face, but for my cuticles. And that's what I got it for. All right. Now this next item is the top secret concealer. I haven't tried this and um, this has rave reviews and it comes like in this little pot. The color I picked out is called nude. Again, this is called the AOA top secret concealer and it has good reviews so let's check her out together let's see okay comes like that nice little cream and let's put it right here and okay it's definitely thicker a lot thicker um, compared to the AOA liquid concealer this is a lot thicker if you don't want something thick, get this, and this will still give you the coverage. Um, I'm going to try this because it has really good coverage, as you could tell. A little goes a long way. Uh, I'm going to see what it looks like because I got to make sure it's not going to fall in my creases and make me look kind of like crazy. So, yeah, I look forward to trying that. But this one is a definite go-to. So that's a new one for me, though, okay? There you go. Some options for concealers. Then um, we do have some of the AOA and these should be lips. These should be lips. Okay. This one's called cuddles and this was a dollar. So let's try out cuddles. I was looking for some neutrals because it's winter and autumn. This is the time when you can pull out this darker, deeper, richer, colors not only in your makeup you know the darker richer cranberry burgundy purple all those beautiful rich tones um you could do it with your clothing as well so again this one's called cuddles has like a, almost like this really nice neutral type look thing and there's the lippy and let's try it over here on this hand because okay so there she is it is a, a nice neutral. Let's build it up. One, two, three. So you could definitely build it up. Okay. That's pretty. And it feels um, good. It feels like moisturizing. Okay. Then this next one is called Swoon. So let's open her up and let's see what it looks like on hand. I've never tried these and I'm really digging this packaging. It's kind of giving me uh, the Kardashian feel for some of their perfumes that I have um, that are like this that I haven't shared with you guys, but they're in my collection regardless. I'll share them with you one day. But uh, again, this one's Swoon. Oh, that one's really pretty. Look, I'm like, you see it? So that one's Swoon and this one's Cuddles. Okay. Very nice. Very nice. I like it. I'm excited. Okay, then this was new for me. This is a Silky Lash Boost Serum. I read the reviews written by people, real life people, and they said that they saw a difference in their lashes. So this is this was a couple of bucks. Okay, this wasn't like cheap, cheap. This was a couple of bucks. And I was, you know, and there's an applicator. I don't smell anything, which is good. So I think I'm going to have to put this in my nightly routine, my regimen, because um, it tells you what it is to say. It says, apply a thin layer of serum along your 
upper and lower lash line for best results repeat application twice a day okay so you can do it twice a day and this is supposed to help um, get more uh, healthier lashes so if your lashes are thin um, people have used this and have seen a difference so that's why I picked it up because this girl needs a little help okay I can't get it back in a box all right we don't need the box all right this next thing is the turmeric and rosemary this is a face mask I'm not gonna pop it open because I'm not ready to use it yet but it is a AOA and it is totally new to me um, but turmeric and rosemary are all very good things so I was like oh, I gotta give this one a go and I got it on sale then I found the AOA what is this this should be a lippy right this should be a lippy this should be a lippy Libereth. Labyrinth, Libereth, Labyrinth. You guys know what I mean. Yeah, this should be a lippy because I was looking for lippies. Lipsticks, neutrals. This one's rather dark. Okay, let me see if I get. Okay, there we go. I got it open. <sighs> this girl's not weak. Okay, so this is Labyrinth and this is more like a pencil. And that's very nice. You see that? So if I want to do it lighter with a lighter hand, I could. Do you see that? So it's really up to you, the kind of color that you want. If you want it to be a deep color versus a lighter color. Very nice. I like it. I like it. And then this one's called, what's your name, girl? Silken. So she's silken. And um, I wish they would say and make a big because uh yeah lip crayon i just want to make sure i'm not you know talking outside of my face when i'm telling you this lip crayon and it might not be okay so here's like lighter and then me going you know full on so you can get two different shades going there okay very pretty very slick like very smooth gliding um i like it so then i wanted to get it's winter cold and my lips are drying up my kids lips are drying up so i wanted to get the sweet pout sugar lip scrub i heard a lot of people uh, talk about how good this is and i think i picked up the orange they come in different flavors so this is a lip sugar scrub okay and she looks like that oh and the orange smell is very nice very nice this is this is not let's see i'm putting it on as we my lips are like super dry right now as we speak okay okay i'm starting to get to the granules now i was like i don't feel any granules the eye i'm getting them now the granules are sugar mm. Mm, that's a nice scrub but very moisturizing too oh this is nice it's, it's almost like a thick like a super thick vaseline but with the sugar and the scent okay that's nice okay and this is the next one this is called the froyo lip balm they have these in different colors and flavors this particular one is called caramel whip cream and i am a lip balm fiend i love lip balms i love getting anything that's you know themed for the season so this is themed for the season and i wanted something seasonal so i wanted to do caramel so let's see what she looks like okay so it looks like that and you see there's the holder and yeah it smells like caramel let me see if I can put it here because I, I got the lip scrub on. So it comes out, it comes out just a little bit of sheen, just a little bit. But you don't get the caramel smell that's very, very, very strong, which could be a good thing or a bad thing. It's very light. It's very light. Okay, so there you go. It's a light caramel whipped cream type of scent. Um, once I put it on my lips, I'll probably have a better experience with it versus my my hand okay and i also picked up the aoa look how pretty that packaging is it has the pretty flowers these colors are insane it's called cherry blossom 
Okay. And it's a little tiny baby palette. I mean, look how little that is. So you have all these really pretty colors in a very tight, compact space, but I fell in love with it because, um, all the colors are like great autumn colors. So we have like a metallic, like, um, matte, matte glitter, metallic, metallic, metallic. Okay. So it's like a nice little mix. So let's see. So that's that one. Can you see that? Yeah, you can see it. Here's a matte. There's a matte. Let me make sure this finger is clean. Let me do this glitter one. Yeah, that one has a nice color. Okay, that's nice. Let's do this one. And then that one. This one's a little bit chalky. But, you know, for a dollar and some change, you know, this is going to be a nice one to work with. The, and the colors are just fabulous. Okay. Then, now let me, <laughs> let me wipe my hands one more time. Because <sighs> I don't want to get anything messed up, y'all. Okay. Here we go. I know it's probably driving you nuts seeing that coverage stuff there. Let me see. Okay. All right. Then I got these two necklaces and this, this is what they look like. Okay. So this is necklace number one. Let's, this has like a really pretty purple with a gold chain. And this one has a really pretty blue. And let me take it out. So you got your two chains. Okay, as you can tell, and then you got this really gorgeous big, it's very, see the side view, it really sticks out, the heart. Um, it's a very light the center necklace, it's like super light, almost air-like feel to it, and then this one is not too heavy at all. This kind of reminds me of, um, was it Tiffany that had this kind of um, chain before? I also have one. Um, from QVC from which designer it was not cheap and it's a solid sterling silver oh, I forgot but she did these hearts and all this stuff too and I have that from her mine's an amethyst but these are absolutely gorgeous let me show you the purple so the only two jewelry pieces that I picked up that I thought were really pretty and unusual this has this really pretty purple color but this one's not sitting in here very well but they're all kind of like you know they're just big, but this one's a little wonky. This one's a little bit on the wonky side. Yeah, it's like sticking out a little bit more on that side. Can you tell? Yeah, it's like a little wonky. But there you have it. I mean, you're paying a dollar for jewelry. Uh, what can you expect, right? <laughs> you're paying a buck. Come on. Then um, the last item here that I picked up, I believe this is a scarf. So let me find the opening for this and we can look at this together okay there we go beautiful okay and this is like a beautiful velvet um it does do you see that it has the um i don't know if you can see it <sighs> let me see if i can get you guys to see it Oh, look, this is the kind of like a neck piece. I didn't know it was going to be like a neck piece, like a neck piece. So this is by Sachi. Do you see that? Sachi. So this goes right around your neck. And I guess you could wrap it around your head if it's cold. It's not like a scarf scarf. I thought it was like a scarf scarf, but it's not. It's like one of those really tight ones. Oh, I'm still going to use it though. Especially when it's cold outside when I'm sitting in the car waiting for the kids. Um, this would be a nice one to pull over my hair. So yeah, so we got a whole bunch of really cool stuff here. I'll put my link down below so you guys can go shopping. They have some really good deals right now. And um, yeah, so let me pull it all out so you guys can see everything again. <laughs> Lots of fun goodies here for me to try. And um, thank you so much for coming by and I'll talk to you later. Bye.